this project that Lizzie and I have been working on started 2019, actually. I think December of 2019 is when we uh, had this idea. So one of the big uh, emphases that we have had as a mission committee and as a church is how do we not just be a multi-ethnic church in terms of worship, but how do we be a multi-ethnic church in terms of mission? And so a lot of our focus in 2019 and 2020 uh, has started with the children. And so as a way to do this, uh, Jonathan started uh, the, the gospel children on Wednesday nights, and we added a missions component where we had uh, many different people share. A lot of you have shared uh, for the kids. You've either come in costume as someone else or shared about another uh, people group to help the kids uh, understand how global God's mission is. It's not just about here. And so this morning, we have another project that we've been working on. We have some cutouts that I'll show you in just a second. And uh, Lizzie did just a fabulous job with those. So Lizzie, would you tell us just a little bit about the process? I know you had some small helpers and whatnot, so we'd love to hear more about it. Yeah, so when Brian brought up this, um, this idea to me, which you're going to see in a second, um, it immediately resonated with my heart and passion for missions. And um, so we got busy working on it 2019. Um, and so with my, I'm an artist, and with my art, I primarily work from life. I do portraiture from life. Um, and so in order to um, follow my normal process, I had to get some little models to help me out. Um, my niece, Penny, which you can see the picture, um, was very gracious to dress up in, in uh, various attire and let me sketch her. And then uh, I think we have another picture. She, <laughs> she held very still for these. She did such a good job, you can, as you can tell. Um, and then Crockett, my nephew, also helped me. Um, they were very good sports, and yes, I bribed them and, and lots of candy. <laughs> um, so I started each painting with, um, we primed plywood, sanded and primed, and then I did light sketches using my little model's help, and um, for just for accurate proportions and, and detail, and uh, then worked the sketches into full life drawings, and then from there, applied multiple coats of acrylic paint and then finished them off with a lacquered top coat. So that's the, the basic process. But um, what you're going to see is it's fun and colorful, but it's meant to be so much more than that. Um, they, they will be fun, and I hope they'll be used and enjoyed. Um, but they are meant to be uh, an interactive reminder that every one of us is called to be a missionary and to step into someone else's shoes and to get to know their story and share the gospel of Jesus Christ with them. So I hope you enjoy these. So we have three that we'll be revealing uh, this morning. And then after the service, feel free, come up uh, and get pictures with them or in them as you like. Um, and then we will do three more on the fifth Sunday of January. So here we go. So I had told Lizzie, look, just big block colors is fine. Uh, I said, if any, you know, if, if you don't do this, it's going to be mean. It's just going to be stick figures with uh, hole cutouts. And so she just went uh, over the top. So thank you, Lizzie. We really appreciate that. We are, we are trying to be representative around the world. And between these and the next, uh, we have a lot of different regions represented and so this, uh, this young girl right here, she is a Quechua girl. She's from the Quechua people group, which is in the Andes Mountains in Peru. And so you might have seen somebody with a towel over their head and a rope around their neck. Uh, that, was the, that was the llama. That was Crockett. Uh, what's that? <laughs> that was Crockett. That was Crockett, okay. Blanket on his head. Um, and this girl is uh, Berber. She's from North Africa. The Berbers are historically a nomadic people in the desert that go across multiple countries. They're largely uh, Islamic. And then the final young man down here, he is from Kashmir. Kashmir is a region uh, between India and Pakistan uh, that is kind of a disputed region that honestly would probably like to be left alone. Uh, they are predominantly Muslim. Kids in gospel, kids, you might remember, we talked about the Kashmir region uh, one Wednesday night. And so this boy is from the Kashmir region. Uh, Lizzie, would you close us in a short word of prayer? Absolutely. 
Well, Father, we just thank you so much for this opportunity to gather together this morning and worship you with um, with our voices, with art, with um, the word uh, teaching. And Lord, I just lift up this project to you um, and offer it to you, Lord, as an offering. And I just pray your blessing on it, that as the children and even adults come and enjoy these um, paintings, I just pray, Lord, that we would all be reminded of the mission that you've set before us um, to minister to your people all over the world and um, to continue spreading the gospel, regardless of um, distance, regardless of challenges. But um, Father, I thank you that you will empower us to train up this next generation to be bold um, believers for you who will continue that mission on. In Jesus' name, amen. <laughs> 